at this animal that I'm drawing. Um, a lot of kids like to play, well not with this animal, but the toy of the animal. Yeah, you've guessed that it's a dinosaur. Dinosaurs are pretty special because they don't, they're not around anymore, right? They first appeared about 230 million years ago. And they all died out about 66 million years ago. So actually they only lived during that period of time. And they died out before humans even existed. So um, this time period we call the dinosaur period as well. Now how do we know that dinosaurs existed? Because I mean we can't see them. We don't have them around. If you go to a forest you're not going to find a dinosaur. So how do we know they existed? Well. Um, there were many plants and animals that lived on the planet before us and we find evidence in, in stone in stone fossils we call them so fossils are prints of uh, plants and animals that lived at a per particular period of time um, another way to to know which animals used to live is to find their bones right we're all made out of bones all these so you can find bones or skeletons of an animal and you can try and guess what it looked like. So that's how we know dinosaurs were real or they existed. One of the most popular kinds, well you can see here there are different kinds of dinosaur, right? Some are short, small, with different kinds of horns, they come in different shapes and sizes. Some eat meat, some eat um, vegetables. So there are many different kinds of them, right? They're not all the same, it's not just one kind of an animal. Um, the most popular or the most well-known kind of dinosaur is called the Tyrannosaurus rex or T-Rex. And T-Rex is really interesting because it looks quite scary as you can see here. Um, it is one of the largest meat eaters to have ever lived on this planet. It was about 4 meters tall, 12 meters long and really fast and had big, big teeth. So it's quite scary. Here you can see a fossil of a T-Rex and one of the most best preserved fossils was found in 1988 in Montana, USA. Uh, Montana is one of the states in America, you can see it here in, in red. So who fa found it? Well, Kate, Kathy Wankel and her husband Tom were um, hiking around in Montana and they found it. So it's not actually the archaeologists that found it, it was just random hikers who were hiking there. Um, it is very well preserved and it's one of the top five T-Rex fossils when it comes to the level of preservance. 80 to 85 percent of it is still intact. Now um, it is owned by the, as you can see here, the Army Corps of Engineers, but they don't have it. So if you want to go see it, you're not going to go to them actually, you're going to go somewhere else. So where? Where can you see this T-Rex? Well, um, they've given a 50-year-long loan to the National Museum of History, National History Museum. It is the second most visited museum in the world, and it's very, very big. Um, so a lot of people, millions and millions of people go see it every year. So if you want to go see T-Rex, you have to go there. Um, the museum is in Washington, D.C., which is the capital of the U.S. You can see here the little red dot. So if you want to see the T-Rex, you should go to... Washington DC. Okay, thank you for joining us today to talk about um, dinosaurs. Don't forget to check us out at www.hellokidstoday.com. You can also check out our um, other stories as well. Take care. Have a good day. Bye-bye.